Welcome to CFP Distilled March 2021. My name is Dr. Simon Moore and along with Dr. Paul Dillon, this month we're going to talk about sport-related concussion, milk allergy, as well as diagnosing asthma. Cow's milk protein allergy in children. We have to think about efficacy, we think about cost and taste test for those picky infants. What are the four different types of formulas that we can use that we need to balance those pros and cons? There's amino acid based formulas, there's soy based formulas, rice based formulas and completely hydrolyzed milk protein formulas as well. Read the article to find out what the pros and cons are. How do we help those patients who they've got asthma but the spirometry was normal? It looks like they've got asthma, smells like asthma, tastes like they've got asthma. They've got a cough, it's unexplained, the spirometry was normal. Turns out spirometry in asthma is only 29% sensitive according to this month's CFP journal article. Now. How do we help these patients? We send them for a methacholine challenge. A third of patients with asthma symptoms and a normal spirometry are gonna be positive on their methacholine challenge. Sport-related concussion management. Is there something that we have been missing? Adding the PHQ-9, another validated score in addition to the STAT-5, can improve your pickup of depression in these patients. This is something we've been missing in the past. Add it to your arsenal. Thank you so much for watching CFP Distilled March 2021. Check out our website at cfpdistilled.com and find out what's coming next with regards to our upcoming conferences.